Pacific Ocean, the biggest ocean in the world in the setting of the largest international maritime exercise. Held once every two years, the Rim of the Pacific Exercise, or RIMPAC, is hosted by the United States Navy in Hawaii. Through the planning and execution of complex naval warfare serials, Exercise RIMPAC provides an important training opportunity to enhance interoperability between participating forces, improve readiness for a wide range of potential operations, and strengthen military-to-military -military partnerships. RIMPAC brings together 26 nations from North and South America, Europe, Asia, and Oceania. It's fitting that the world's largest maritime exercise is centered on the world's largest and most important ocean. Protecting and navigating these shared interests increasingly rests on the hulls of our ships, the wings of our aircraft, and on the backs of every mariner represented here at RIMPAC. RIMPAC gives us a chance to work with established navies in very high-end and very complex scenarios. And as a result, it gives us the opportunity to really hone our warfare capabilities. And of course, with so many navies participating from all around the world, it gives us an opportunity to interact with and expand those collaborations with our friends from all over the world. This year's exercise for impact involved 26 countries with 45 ships, 5 submarines, over 200 aircraft and 25,000 personnel. RSS Steadfast was part of a clever strike group and led a task unit of three other ships from Korea, Japan and the United States through serials such as helicopter operations, gunnery firings and maneuvering drills. This was the third time the Republic of Singapore Navy or RSN commanded a task unit. For Steadfast, uh, this year, we've been given uh, additional opportunities to take up leadership roles. During the sea phase itself, we are commander task unit in charge of uh, three other ships from uh, Japan, Korea and the US. It's important progress because it shows that we have established ourselves as a key partner, as a key participant in RIMPAC. And our hosts and the other members of RIMPAC feel that we are ready to take up greater roles and allow us to contribute in uh, larger areas. Before the ship slipped off to train at sea, crew from the various navies visited each other's ships as part of a cultural and professional exchange, forging friendships and bonds among the countries. One by one, the ships departed Pearl Harbor for the next phase of the exercise a physically and mentally demanding 24-day sail in the Pacific Ocean. Rough seas and challenging sea serials lay ahead, and the crew on board RSS Steadfast steeled themselves for the mission. Catch all the action in part 2 of Exercise Impact 2016.